every time you share, like you were part of the Masterful Manifestors. And really, I really, every time you would share, you would bring an open heart and love and compassion to the group. Mm -hmm. And so it was always so wonderful when you'd share with us and you'd have posts and you'd encourage one another. How was it for you as far as being part of the Masterful Manifestors group? <laughs> Man, you know how sometimes you just don't really understand something until somebody else shines a light on it, right? Like you, you're there, you're in the middle of it, you're doing the thing, but there, was, there wasn't, you know what I mean? It was just kind of like, I don't even know how I ended up there. You just, I think you just posted something. You're like, hey, let's make a million dollars in 90 days. And all of us were like, yeah. You know I mean? me too and then we just started this thing and it was just this really beautiful organic um i mean i don't know what it was like behind the scenes for you guys i mean obviously it was a lot more than what my experience was because here we are and you guys have created something from that um but for me it was just kind of like oh yeah where are we going we're going over here and i just was going along for the ride until actually the other day um talos contacted me and he was like Hey, so have you thought about, you know, joining the, the next one? And I was like, no, dude, no, I can't, you know, no, I don't have time for that. I can't be bothered with, I can't, I just can't even fathom in my life, like adding one more zoom class. Like that was cool. It was cool. I mean, it was, I, I showed up every week. I, a hundred percent it benefited my life 100 percent. I would not be where I am today without it, but I just, I just couldn't deal with that. And then he posted a live where he was just sharing his own experience, which is like really what I, and I think all of us resonate more with is like that personal experience and the way that other human beings see things and the way it affected them. And when he was talking about, you know, having this group and the consistency and the intentional high vibration, and even because we weren't always high at the same time, you know what I mean? Or like life happens every week, life is happening. <laughs> And then COVID hit and here we are in this really powerful, intentionally progressive, intentionally high vibration, intentionally forward moving, intentionally lifting each other up place where we are, everyone else is going like that. And all of us are like, Whoa, like going this way. And I didn't even really have words for it or understand it in that way of like, holy cow wow, that, that is, that's the reason why I'm where I'm at today. And everyone I, else I know, well, you guys, right? Well, we're all over here, like feeling really good and really powerful and really positive, even though there's a lot to do and a lot to work on and a lot to heal. And so many people I know are struggling so deeply with life, meaning, purpose, energy, food cravings, like you know, just like goes on and on. So as soon as Taylor shared that, I was like, wow. And then that thought of the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again, expecting a different result. And I have, I have thought about that definition a million times in my life and really tried to do something different. <laughs> Did so many areas like to get a different results, try anything. Any, so something's got to work better than this. Um, and then it kind of, it switched around and it was like, no real insanity is not doing something that did work. Like, why would you stop oh doing something that was working for you? Anyway, so that, that is how I ended up here again. I was like, oh my God, you're totally right. I see it. I feel it. I need it. 